We'll see how these two teams play in this game as they prepare for the opening kickoff. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. California's offense, a lot of times they can spread things out and they can really be versatile offensively, but when you've got a wide receiver like this, it really helps the pace. Well, it does, and it, and it continues to help with what they're trying to do. They're trying to find matchups, and when you have one player like this that the defense has got to be aware of, they're going to spread you out, try to find a one-on-one -on -one matchup, and if you spend too much time with this one player, they've got some other weapons to make you pay for it. First down. From their own 38-yard line, it's first down. Out of bounds at the 41. About three yards on the play fake. This young wide receiver has the raw ability to make some big plays. So that was a good job there by the defense to stop him for a short game. Now he's scrambling. And down he goes around the 42-yard line. Third and six. Ball on the 42-yard line. Drop down at about the 43-yard line. A yard, if any, there for the halfback. The ball changes hands on the punt. Nice opening stand by the defense. Boy, the crowd was loud and did their part. Now if they're able to move the ball downfield, they can take control of this game early. Now the offense gets ready to take their first crack at it. And he carries the ball for a nice game. So it's second down now, and they need about four yards to pick up the first. He fights forward to about the 40. That's a gain of two on the play. That'll bring up third and two. You like to see a team having success like this running the football. It can really open up things for the offense. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on their own 48. it up the middle for a nice run. That makes it seven and six. Tackle made at the 46-yard line. A yard, maybe two on the carry. They'll line it up again on third down. This quarterback is tough as nails, Brad. He's going to sit in that pocket and give himself a chance. The only problem is, at some point, you've got to have a feel. Almost that sixth sense on when to get out of there and avoid the pressure, or just to throw the ball before you get hit. Oh, excellent punt. This punt goes over the goal line, and this will be a touchback. Stanford's defense got the stop they wanted on that first drive. Now let's see if they can do it again. And just listen to this crowd, Brad. I mean, you can practically feel the energy coming down from the crowd and how it's impacting these players. I don't think either team has a clear advantage so far. Let's see if they can make some plays and get a little separation. Here's the throw. I don't think he got anything on that. From their own 23-yard line, second down. They'll line up with five wide receivers. Tackle at the 32. This isn't even the best example, but I'm going to tell you something. This young man is really getting better at running his routes, which is a truly underrated quality these days. He's to the 40. 
gains his way to the 46-yard line. And he has a huge run. I'll tell you right now, this guy is arguably one of the fastest players in college football today. There you see him turn it upfield with such fluidity and quickness. From their own 46-yard line, first down. He's knocked out of bounds at the 45. That brings and he's tackled around the 43-yard line. They move the sticks after another first down. Impressive drive by this offense so far. I really like what they're doing by keeping this defense on their heels and moving the ball downfield. Makes the catch and look out. And they make the stop at the 31 yard line. Number 25 on the tackle. First and 10. Ball on the 31 yard line. First and 10. Hey, check, check Mike 11. Check Mike 11. Hey, let's get that ball, D. Let's get that ball. Ready. He's at the 20. He gets out to about the 8. That's a big 23 on the way. That makes it first and goal. Here's the eighth play of the series. And he's immediately tackled. That's good for a gain of five yards. That brings us second and goal. They're at the three. Second down. Played one quarter. No score here. And we're back for more action here in quarter number two. play 80 yard drive and they come away with a touchdown Fred I thought the offense did a really nice job of mixing up the play calling on that drive I thought the defense was on its heels to most of the drive because of the versatility of the offense and it sails out of the end zone for a touchback momentum swings have been fairly even and with so little separation this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays the middle for a nice game. That's a deep that brings him second, and five. second down and five. Ball on the 30-yard line. And they get nice yardage on that run. Gain of five on the play. Third down. him hard at the 37-yard line. First and 10. Ball on the 37. They're packed in tight on the line. Nice run over the middle. Five yard line. First down. 
That's a great tackle at the 30. That's another first down, Brad. And right now, you can just really feel and sense the rhythm that this offense is in. Their ability to pick up first downs, just pushing this defense further and further down, back deep into their own territory. He's tackled around the 28-yard line. That's a game of two on the play. That makes it second and eight. And this is the eighth play of the drive. First and ten, ball on the 18-yard line. He makes it out to maybe the 16-yard line. Gain of two on the play. That makes it. This is the tenth play of this drive. They come out in a goal line set. Let's go. Black 90. Black 90. Makes it out to maybe the 13-yard line. Three-yard gain by the running back. With the safeties coming up, making plays near the line of scrimmage, that tells your offense they've got to start throwing the ball to keep them honest. And so it's another third down upcoming here. Win of this one. Even though they didn't sack him, the pressure was still enough to force a bad pass. If you can get in there and disrupt the pocket, then the quarterback is going to have a tougher time getting the ball to his playmakers. The kick is up, and they tack on three points. Stanford gets set to kick this one away. Excellent kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. California is up by four. Complete, he's got room. Well, you give up too many passes like that, and the game will be done before you know it. They cannot let these receivers get behind them. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 50-yard line. Hit out of bounds at the 48. That makes it second and eight. Check three, check three. Let's go, go, here we go. Let's go. Quick throw incomplete. One of his receiver. Third down, and they need to get it inside the 40. Yard line. He looked pretty cool back there. Even with the outside linebacker blitzing, he made an accurate throw, and the result is a new set of downs. It's first and ten. Ball on the 28-yard line. the catch and gets out of bounds. That's a gain of 12 on the play. That makes it first and 10. California holds a four-point lead. 
They'll bring him down to the 20-yard line. Just nowhere for the ball carrier to go as the linebacker met him in the backfield. Boy, what great play recognition by this linebacker. He saw the run was coming, and he just shot through the gap and made a great tackle. And he is drilled the 17-yard line. This is the eighth play of this drive. With a quick throw. This one is incomplete. Nice job getting a hand on that one. Yeah, really good heads up play there to get a hand on the football by the defense. So it's fourth down. So the field goal unit is on the field. They'll try for three points. Kicks away, and it's through the uprights. They line up to kick this one away. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And they can forget about returning this one. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. This defensive coordinator is not afraid to send the house. He brought every linebacker, and the quarterback was still able to convert the first down. Quick throw out to the receiver. Locked down at about the 47-yard line. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. prepared defense. They know where to be, and they know what their opponent likes to do. They play tight coverage as well. From the 22-yard line, second down. Let's go! Now he tries to buy some time. Slides down to the ground. Passes. Tight end's got another one. He's pushed out of bounds at the 10 yard line. And this play is number eight on the drive. He gets it up, and the field goal is good. Points were very hard to come by in those first two quarters. They'll head to the locker room. Golden Bears lead it by four. Hi, everybody. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. This is Davis, Dave Pollock here in the studio as always to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. What a terrific first half. This is everything we anticipated this game being. And we're going to be riveted to this game, I feel like, David, in the second half, anticipating a terrific finish. It's, it's fun. It's, it's, it's living up to the hype every single time. We can't even turn the channel here. We got it on the big screen, on the big 60-inch. Yes, it's quite nice, by the way, too. The weather's nice and warm. It's beautiful. Got some chips. We're opening them up a little bit. But great game, living up to the hype. It definitely feels like both teams are evenly matched. It feels like it can go either way. It feels like it's going to come down to the wire. And the only thing I hope it doesn't come down to is a kicker. Please don't come down to a kick in the end. Both these teams playing great D, playing great O, you know, physical, you know, pounding on each other, making big plays. Don't come down to a finesse kick by like a, a soccer player, please. David and I will stay locked in on everything going on in college football. It's going to wrap it up here in the studio. Just about time to get you out to your second half. Brad and Kirk ready with a call. Very close game now as we start the second half. 
He sends this one deep. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. You know, this offense is doing a pretty good job moving the football. The problem is they're not coming up with touchdowns. The offense coordinator who's been up here next to us, Brad, in the booth next to us, he's actually just taking off his headsets, and I think he's going down to the field to be next to the quarterback and the rest of this offense to try to engage with them to realize how important it is to finish these drives. They go to the left for a nice game. From their own 29-yard line, it's second down. Mike one, Mike one. Ready, red 18. Here's a run. Tackle made at the 30-yard line. Caught, and this is going to be a first down. 41 yard line from their own 41 yard line it's first down and a quick throw and he's tackled at about the 33 yard line From the 33 yard line. First down. Here's a running play. Runs it left for a decent game. That'll make it second and seven. Line up in the jumbo set. Tackled for a loss. The blockers tried to sell the misdirection, but the defenders stayed home and made the play. That's the kind of effort a coach likes to see from his defense. Third down, and they need to get it to the 23. He's tackled in the open field. Here's the eighth play of the series. Inside the 10, and that sets them up for the first and goal. It's first down, and they'll be looking for six points here. He's going to try and scramble. And they make the stop around the three-yard line. Here's play number 10 on the drive. Joseph moves and he's in. The halfback just plowed his way into the end zone. Yeah, but it wasn't all him. The offensive lineman just pancaked the defense on that one. So the kicker will line up here and try to give his team a three-point lead with this extra point. And he converts the extra point. A 10-play, 74-yard drive, and a touchdown as a result. The score now, 13-10. Stanford ready to kick this one off. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. This deficit can be easily overcome, sure. But they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. Fires right side. He's got his tailback. He steps out around the 34-yard line. That brings up second and It's second down now, and they're just a few feet away from that first down marker. Hey, check, check back, 11, check Ready. Back, 11. He's on the run. 
He's at midfield. Makes it out to about the 46. Call it a game of 20 yards. First down. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 46 yard line. Three down, three down. He's under pressure. He's taken down around the 31 yard line. That's good for a gain of 15 yards. That makes it first and 10. From the 31 yard line. First down. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. That'll bring up second and three. The sub package in there defensively in this five wide receiver set. Now he's scrambling. Decides to tuck it in, and he's got space. He's tackled around the 14-yard line. That's a good First down. Man left, man left. First and 10. Ball on the 14. In the shotgun and five wideouts. They'll knock him down for a loss. The offensive line needs to do a better job of not only handling the defensive linemen, but getting up to the linebackers. That way the ball carriers will have a little bit more room to get to that second level. The 10, and he's taken down right around the eight yard line. That's a game of eight on the play. That, that makes, makes it third. And, and this is the eighth play of the drive. Three down, three down. Hey, check, check back, 11, check back, 11. And he carries the ball for a nice game. Call it a gain of five yards. That makes first down, and they've got their eyes on that goal line. Mike 17, Mike 17. Squad, squad, squad. Ready, ready, five. He scrambles. So he keeps it and picks up maybe a yard on the play. Tenth play of the drive. He's on the run. Decides to take it himself, and he's got it. Touchdown. Well, this quarterback has great instincts, but he showed his smarts here as well, seeing that there was room to run for the touchdown instead of trying to force the pass. And he adds the extra point. quarter of action remaining and this one has been a real treat. California's up by four. The California lines up for the kickoff. He really got a hold of that kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Well, this is a very competitive game. Just when you think one team has gained the advantage or the momentum, the other team comes fighting back, and it's going back and forth. This is almost like a basketball game. This is a pretty crucial series right here. With things being so tight, your best players have to step it up on both sides of the ball. The defense was able to get really good penetration and drop him short of the line of scrimmage. That brings up second and 13. Welcome back to the action here as we resume play here in quarter number four. Three down, three down. Mike one, Mike one. Ready. They'll bring him down at the 31. They're about four yards away here on third down. Here we go. 
Looking for the corner. He's to the 40. Gets out to around the 45. He makes it out to maybe the 46 yard line. That's a gain of one on the way. That brings up second and nine. From their own 46 yard line. Second down. Maybe two on the carry. That's, That's good for a gain of two yards. yards. Third down. You know, at that point, I think, Brad, the quarterback's just better off just taking a sack. You have to be very careful as you're feeling pressure to throw the ball just to throw the ball. If you feel like you're not going to be able to make a play and the defense got you, just give up on that play and get ready for the next down. And down he goes at the 45-yard line. This is the eighth play of this drive. Slings it. Brought down around the 35-yard line. Short yardage situation here. Second down and one. Just under three to go in regulation. Makes the catch and he might take it. Touchdown saving tackle. But it leaves him with a first and goal. Well, this is it. They've got all four downs to get in the end zone. to go up by three. They'll kick the extra point. He makes the PAT. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. He just drills this one. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The Golden Bears have got to be fired up how this game is going. they still got a chance to win. Well, you're talking about a huge underdog that's battled the entire game. They've got the football here to start this drive late with a chance to take the lead. You can't even imagine what this would do for this football team if they could put six points up on the board. Gets rid of it quickly, and that was almost picked. This just shows you that you don't need to be sacking the quarterback to disrupt the passing game. Second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 25-yard line. Let's go! They'll make the sack. But the defense is fired up, responding and reacting to that sack. Not only do they get the quarterback, but they hit him and hit him hard. I think that can really create some confidence for this defense. The next time this quarterback drops back to throw, you got to be thinking he's going to be a little bit gun-shy and concerned about the pressure that these defense is putting on him. Offense lines up in a five-wide set in the defense, anticipating pass here. Goes quickly, and it's almost intercepted. Hey, this guy's got to forget about the drop. Remember, he was in good position to make a play. Just over two minutes in the game. He really got a hold of that one. Gets to about the 47-yard line. You know this is a real crucial time in the game. It could still go either way. That's a great tackle. And 
the 45. They get to the quarterback and end that play before it even got started. This young man didn't even have a chance to make something happen. It's tough to find your receivers when the defense is in your face like that. Tailback brought down for a loss. And he was pretty much stuffed on that run. You know what, that was just a nice job by the defense in stopping him before he could get going and build up momentum. And he's met immediately. On the third and long, they decided to run it. No, it's not that crazy here because they have the lead in the fourth quarter, so their main focus is to keep that clock running. Oh, excellent punt. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Golden Bears have sort of set up the defense with this wide receiver doing most of the damage. Do they go away from him or do they do something different? I think one of two things here for this offense. You either find a way to get your star receiver the football or, in some cases, you want to use him as a decoy, maybe take two or three defenders with him and then open it up for somebody else to be able to make a play. There's a strike complete. And he shoved out of bounds to 39-yard line. First down. From their own 39-yard line, it's first down. Just under two to go in the game. And he tackles him hard at the 33-yard line. And he stops the clock with a spike. I'm here all day. Hey. Green 95. Well, that's just a huge stop right there here late in the fourth quarter in a game this tight. That might be one we look back on later and say that won the ball game. Fourth and long here after the sack. Once and all, going deep. So the play of the day, fourth and ball game, and the defense comes up with the stop of the day and what will be the win. Late in the fourth quarter in a one-possession game, and poise is what it's all about here. Who's going to have it and who won't? And this should be a kneel down as they just try to kill the clock. Second down, about 12 yards to go. Ball on the 27-yard line. Let's go! Black with the five! The halfback with a carry. He takes it right side for a good game. That makes it 37. This one's in the books, and our final score, 2017, Cardinal. So, Kirk, how would you sum up the action of this one? Well, they can breathe a big sigh of relief now. Things weren't always looking so sure today. They could have been looking at a pretty big letdown. Stanford got a much tougher game than they were expecting. But any good team has to be able to win the close ones, too, not just the blowouts. Thanks for joining us for another game of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk and everyone here at EA Sports, Brad Nussler saying goodbye, and we'll see you next time.